What is going on your ones near Rianne? Here for you, an episode of Moab Friday, this time the map lockdown. Using the PP90 with the golden camo and the extended mag, and ladies and gentlemen, this is quite possibly the world's first, that's right, world's first, hip fire only assault, my lab. Now, before you run to your keyboards, oh, no, 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 just sit back, I understand that there's a bunch of hip fire only Moabs on YouTube. I've watched a bunch of them, I went through and previewed a bunch of them, but all of them were specialists. This quite possibly could be the first one with assault streaks, you know, who knows. Uh, is it? Probably not. I mean, <laughs> look at the stuff you can find on YouTube, alright? People are like getting Moabs while like, sit like standing backwards looking in a mirror and playing off the mirror in their TV and they're getting Moabs that way, right? <laughs> Throughout all the people that post videos of Mauver 3, chances are it's probably not the first, but it's still kind of a cool Moab, I thought. You know, hip firing only, definitely something different. I mean, uh, the challenge is there. You know, hip firing, that, that that can be a challenge. But then again, he does have the PP90, which PP90 is probably the best hip fire gun in the game. So who knows? I mean, it's a matter of opinion, I guess. In my opinion, it's pretty cool. You guys may think differently. Let me know in the comment section below. But. You know what? I'm not going to talk much about gameplay. I mean, what do you guys want me to do? So you're going to talk about hip firing for three or four minutes? No. I'm going to talk about <laughs> I'm gonna talk about something a little bit different. So let's talk about Mon for 3, uh, Moab, uh, Expectations, and Black Ops 2. That's what we're going to talk about throughout this video. So when the game first came out, any and all Moabs were like the coolest thing in the world, right? I remember uh, my first Moab was with an M16 on mission. And uh, I think that got like 50,000 views. Just and all it was was a uh, titled M16 Moab or Mafia 3 M16 Moab on mission. That's all it was titled. Yeah, it got 50,000 views. So when the game first came out, Moabs were actually somewhat difficult to get. People were excited to see different kinds of Moabs and etc. And it was a cool thing. Now lately, I mean, ever since uh, every basic douchebag player has decided they're just gonna have their you know entire parties run support for them and you know have like plastic vests and unlimited recon drones and UAVs in the air and have their teammates like sit back so they themselves could run through their spawn and do whatever. Now the expectations are like you need to have like a hundred plus kill triple Moab, you know things like that, and you just all these ridiculous. Check out this lag right here. All of these different ridiculous kinds of Moabs, uh, and though though in my opinion they're you know they're achieved through douchebag moves, uh, they're still that's kind of like what the expectation seems to be. So now when like on Subscriber Friday here, which it's called Moab Friday, but essentially it's Subscriber Friday, it's always Subscriber Moabs. Um, like uh, one person sent in a Desert Eagle Moab, another person sent in a 44 Magnum Moab. Uh, D bags, I think it was D bag right here. He got an entire Moab where he basically. Uh, didn't reload the entire time. He just kept picking up different guns. And none of these videos, mind you, were these people having teammates run support for him and whatnot. Yet people don't seem to care because it's not like this 100 plus kill thing. It's not like this giant event. Uh, my thought going into it, I'm like, you know what? It's probably the fact that uh, Mom for 3 is probably at the end of its life cycle because these mobs are posted much later, late, mind you. And I'm think I'm I, I'm kind of torn, but I'm leaning towards this. I'm wondering whether or not it is the fact that these mobs like just aren't that impressive to some people. Like they just don't care. Or are they just like, you know, bored them all for three, they've already seen everything, and, you know, some new crazy mob isn't really going to deteriorate from the fact that they're waiting for Black Ops 2, which is less than a month away. That's what I'm leaning towards. I'm thinking, no matter what I could post right now in terms of Modern Warfare 3 gameplay, people just aren't really going to care that much, because it, you know, Black Ops 2 is less than a month away, guys. I think we're all anxiously awaiting it. I think we're all tired of Modern Warfare 3, and I think that's probably the case. But, you know, you guys may feel differently. Let me know in the comment section below. Uh, but we're quickly wrapping up this gameplay. Um, it was, in my opinion, a pretty uh, impressive Moab. I was very happy with it. Uh, believe it or not, I mean, I like this Moab, but this was actually literally the only Moab sent in to me for Moab Friday. Now, if you guys are unaware, I mean, if you guys have Moabs that are really good ones, link them to me on YouTube. Send me a personal message here on YouTube with the you know subject line reading Moab Friday, and then put a link in there to your Moab, and then if it's good, we'll use it. And then you know, feature your channel. Obviously, I always put a link in the description to the player. Um, that you know got the Moab, so that's kind of a cool thing. But if not, I mean, are you guys bored of Moab Friday? I mean, I'm fine with that too. I mean, I'm not even the one getting the Moabs at this point because I don't even play the game. I mean, what games am I playing right now? I'm playing uh, the Dawn Guard DLC for Skyrim. I'm playing Borderlands 2. And I'm playing like Minecraft and a little bit of Black Ops. We had Black Ops open lobby last night, and that was pretty cool. But uh, we're gonna be calling in the Moab right here. D Bag Swag Mercs is the guy. This is kind of a three peat, a uh, three peat, three peat. Why I say three peat, three peat. I uh, guess yeah, it's his third time. It's his third time here on Moab Friday. I don't even know this guy. People may be under the assumption this guy's my friend or something like that. That's why I always use his Moabs. No, he's the only one that's sending them into me anymore because I don't think people care much about Moab Friday anymore. But whatever. Final score of 64 and 4. Hope you guys all enjoy this gameplay and commentary. And if you did, please remember to rate the video and please let me know in the comment section below. Are you bored Moab for three yet? Are you? Are you waiting for Black Ops to? Let me know. Have a great day, guys. I was banging seven grand rocks as I rolled. I got one gear gold.